My name is Dr. Carrie Purdy, and I'm a dermatologist in Halifax, Nova Scotia. The basics of skin care for atopic dermatitis really are around bathing and skin moisturization at the very basic level. When we think about the skin, we can think about it like brick and mortar. The skin cells are like the bricks, and everything surrounding it is like the mortar. In patients that have atopic dermatitis, the mortar is crumbly, and so certain things can get in, like allergens and bacteria, and other things like water can get out. When we think about treatment for atopic dermatitis, we like to improve that mortar so that patients can have that nice, strong brick wall of skin. For bathing, we like patients to be able to get their skin into the water, help their skin to take up that water, and then try to lock it in with moisturizers. You can use a gentle cleanser for some of the dirty or smelly parts of the body, and in particular with kids if they've been out playing. Moisturizing atopic dermatitis skin is really important. It can help to improve the skin barrier, but it can also decrease the amount of dryness, which can improve itch. The way that I like to describe it to people is that concept of locking in the water that your skin takes up or just improving the barrier um, of your skin, whether they're in a flare or not. Sometimes moisturization is not enough, and for flare-ups, you do need medicated creams and ointments and such to decrease inflammation. Patients and their families don't need to suffer. Lots of people have eczema, and the Eczema Society of Canada has a lot of great information that can really help.